seesaw. It's commander plus, you know, the strategically aligned leadership team. And that's exactly what it was. It was the commander, new commander, actually before I became the commander, walking in saying, uh, hey, we need to strategically align our leadership team. And they can bring, either before they assume command or shortly after they assume command, their leadership team here to the Naval Postgraduate School to be educated, to be equipped, to develop shared direction. Typically, any time a commander takes over a new command, the, the staff's kind of feeling out the new commander. How does he or she think? Uh, and then you have that time frame where the commander's just trying to get their feet on the ground. So the discussions that we had, at the depth that we were able to have them, really accelerated that learning process such that the staff you know, already knew on day one who I was, what my beliefs were, and, and the vision that we had set up for the command. And that really is a shift. In other words, it's not just about preparing the individual commander, it's also about preparing the team that the commander is leading. So now we fast forward uh, a year uh, since. The Spear Workshop is a three-day workshop uh, for commands, both shoreside and operational commands. And teams come from those commands and they work on a specific strategic challenge that they have. So we're just taking what we started last year, building on it, and, and, and incorporating a larger aspect of naval aviation enterprise. And we have facilitators that help work with them. In addition, we have faculty members who are giving lectures on the different components of an effective strategy. This week, what we were able to do was assess the feedback from our public affairs team that came with us. Are they gaining foothold? Um, what do we maybe you didn't get right the first time that we need to make adjustments for? It's just hugely powerful. I saw great traction and, and alignment between our teams where ideas were just flowing back and forth. Well, I think we're a lot more confident as a team that we have a chance for succeeding. We're excited about going back now to our own independent um, areas and sharing what we've learned and what we've accomplished here with our own internal teams and then uh, seeing their confidence grow as well. There's no other major university with multidisciplinary resources that the Naval Postgraduate School has that are focused on the defense, particularly the Navy, which is our primary customer. We definitely would encourage anyone else who's facing any kind of challenge in your organization that you're not really sure how to tackle it, whether it's how to form the right team, how to use the strengths and weaknesses of other members of your team, um, to how to leverage your diverse workforce. That's been very valuable for us and we're going to continue to leverage that going forward. I coined 2018 a year of discovery, and it really was for us to truly understand the issues, the challenges that we had throughout naval aviation, and 2019's a year of results. So the timing of having this workshop right now amongst the senior leaders uh, that are gonna go out and drive those results, uh, again, is, is just priceless.